Hey everyone, my name is Amber. I'm Sherry's. And we're back with another video. We're going to be do continuing our last uh, game stream. But this time we're not streaming because it was not going well for us. So hopefully with some mods um, removed and not streaming, we won't be losing uh, frames and won't be kicked out. I'm hopeful. <laughs> so let's just continue the game here. Okay, so what were we doing? We are going to Valentine. Oh yeah, we're going to find Nick. We just have to go down in the sewer. Not picking up the chunk. In my solo game, I pick up like all the chunk, but I'm not gonna do it here, cause the hell? What well, screaming? He just like fell out of the sky. <laughs> wow, random falling <laughs> raider. I'm just gonna go around that tower because don't wanna find super mutants. Not when I'm just armed with a freaking nine millimeter. Now there is a quest in here somewhere. I forgot which one it was, but I found this super overpowered uh, shotgun that's like 300 damage per shot, and it explodes because the nine millimeter is only sitting at 18. So, 300 is, like, a huge amount. We discovered hubris coming. Uh, do you need explosives? I don't think we do. Make sure we're fully reloaded. Oof, we're running low on ammo. Take the caps. What's the torn letter? I'll look at it later. The funny thing about this type of game is that, yeah, we want to go find our baby, but at the same time, you don't have to. You can do everything but find your baby. <laughs> but isn't the end goal to find the baby? I mean, yeah, you have to do. That's it. the main storyline, yes, but there's still a bunch of other things you could do to, in the game. Um, well, yeah, I know, but I mean, isn't like, don't you still want to go back and find the baby? That's what I mean, like. I just think it's funny that that's the plot they went with because, like, in reality, a I'm parent you, would find their school. child first and foremost, I would think. Not be distracted by, like, anything else. I still say. I mean, that's what you would think. We caught that detective snooping around, and what does he do? Locks him up. Like, he ain't got the balls to just kill him. Well, don't let his new girl hear that. She'll start swinging that bat of hers at your face until there ain't no face left. Where is he at? I, I heard hear them. something. You heard them talking. Here comes somebody. Hey, see us. Our trigger man. Let's see if we can get him in the head. Nice. What? That was good shooting. Alright, he's gonna go behind that door. Wuss! <laughs> I don't have any grenades. You iced him! Shit! Oh, shit. Real bad. <laughs> oh, I'm out of ammo. Because you're missing ammo or something. Yeah, I'm out. Ow, ow. We don't have any ammo. We got this. She's not as powerful. Was that a nine millimeter pistol? Or do we have ten millimeter? I think, I think we 10. have a ten millimeter. Well, we just picked up more ammo for it, so that's good. Caps are always a good thing. Because caps are the money in this world. They're literally bottle caps. 
I only had a bobby pin. Oh, no bobby pins. That sucks. What are bobby pins for the door? Yeah, we can pick locks with it. Okay, we can go back up to our pistol now. Now that we have ammo for it. Ooh, skeletons in the bathroom. You. Take that ammo for. We need all the different ammo we can get right now. Mm. We're gonna go disarm that. Because if we didn't, that grenade would have dropped on us. I'm benefit of playing this game through many times over. Did you get blown up? I had the first time, yes. I don't think I died, but I hurt. Nuka Cola Quantum. Disarm that. That would cause an explosion too. Yeah, see right there. Makeshift bomb. We would have hit that bathroom scale coming around the corner. That bomb would have blown up in our face. Damn. What about that thing? Oh, that's just a light. Yeah. So how many shots you think it's gonna take before we, if we hit him in the head? What do you mean? How much? How many shots you think it's gonna take to kill him? If we, if at all. One. You think we're gonna hit it on the first shot? Yeah. Let's see. Nope. Oh. Second shot though, got him. Well, second shot. I was hoping for a first shot. Wait. This one's probably gonna take more. Oh, damn! Got you! Blanket. Damn, like, missed that guy. Oh, wait, I, it would help if I actually, um... Damn, I think we took that guy out down there. Hitting the freaking uh -huh. shopping cart instead of him. Don't shoot our dog. Our puppy's hurt. Yeah. Somebody shot the dog. Yeah, he's hurt. See? Yeah, that's why I said somebody shot him. He, at least what? he doesn't die. He can't die? No. Oh, that's true. I'm sure there's a mod out there that would let your companions actually die, but... I wouldn't want that. I don't want the doggy to die. Oh, he's crying. Well, he just got shot to hell, though, so. I mean, what do you expect? How good of a weapon is that submachine gun? Is that any better than what we got? Ooh, that deliverer is a 26. Don't want the shotgun. That reload time is that. We don't have much ammo for that. Nope. Okay. We'll use this gun instead. It's silenced too, so that should help. All the ammo we can get, right? Yeah. This is my crappy aim. Why don't you have better aim? That's why I don't PvP, because I suck at the PvP. So I can't aim well. Hmm. Is there something? Oh, there's something over there. Yep, there's a guy.
Get in. <laughs> Got him. Shooting our puppy. Leave our puppy alone. Got you. Don't shoot our puppy. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Leave our puppy alone. Dumb trigger guy. Triggerman. Go away. Might find something. Vault 114. You probably have this game memorized, so. Nah. This is beginning part part because I just did it fairly recently. And this, you know, the first part of the any game you get down really well if you play it enough times. There'll be some choices, real like, game changing choices later on. Got him. We got pretty good aim sometimes. Sometimes. Well, all the time we need to have good aim. Why don't you have good aim all the time? Damn, look at that. Yeah, oh damn. She got to hit us with a bat. No bobby pins. Oh, damn. Where do you find the pins. on the ground or around? What? Usually we found some by now. I guess it's just because I've been picking up a lot of stuff. Purified water. That's good. Purified water is health. I don't think it's stuff right now. So I got a question. Why the hell would anyone build a vault out of a subway station? This place is like the opposite of airtight. Oh, Bobby. They weren't hey, what's up, Bobby? It, you moron. Get it. I got him. Kind of gone all the time, man. Yeah, five. Get a bunch of union boys to work. Some well, let's let them finish talking. Go nowhere. Keep everyone on payroll. Are those guys bad? Yeah. <laughs> Damn, I missed. Blue, we're not alone here. Got him. Before he got through the door. Another one down. That's pretty good. Ow. Just get some health up here. Uh, go on on a stick. Sounds good. Hey, that's the one. Tastes like chicken. Wow. Uh, never had a guana? Get it. <laughs> the dog bit him. Ooh, four percent chance. That's not good. Got him. It's like we're old excavators going to die. Out of the way, dog. Thank you. More bobby pins. Yeah, Yay. get on the bobby pin. You know, it's not that hard to um, pick locks. Oh, it's not? No. Not at all, actually. Well, at least at this level. Master gets a little harder because it's like... It'll, I'll show you when we get there. But I'll take more bobby pins. 
You really want to give us the bobby pins now, huh? Now where are we going? Going further in the vault. That's a big damn vault. I was like, man. Well, I mean, people are going to be living down here. That's like, I know, but it's just like, a lot. I just didn't see one that big before. And obviously, technically, it's bigger because a lot of our ways are blocked off. I mean, obviously, in game, it's not programmed, but if you were to say it's like real life. How you doing in there? Ooh, only four percent. Ooh, but we have a crit. See how it's flashing at the bottom where it says crit? What is the, that's critical hit? Yeah. Get it. Get it. Get it. When you crit, it's automatic hit. 100% chance. Yay! He's dead. As long as you have at least a 1% chance to hit with the crit, it'll go through. So we can pick this lock. So, Miles would move the bobby pin, right? Yeah. Get on here, clicking in the background. Yeah. They click doesn't actually matter, but see how it doesn't want to move? You just have to try to get it to the right spot where it will go. Oop. Where do you want it? I have to... Right there. And that yes. range of where it will fully turn gets smaller and smaller with each level. Hey, you! I don't know who you are, but we got three. Minutes before they talk to him. Yep. I don't love the irony of the reverse That's Nick. in distress scenario. Why is his face so weird? Oh, is he like robot or something? He's a synth. Limb a what? A synth? Wow. Synthetic. Oh. What are you? What are you? Told you. I'm a detective. <laughs> Look, I know the skin and the metal parts ain't comforting, but it's not important right now. The only thing that matters is why you went to all this trouble to cut me loose. What are we saying? Finding Sean, right? I think. My baby's missing. His name's Sean. He was kidnapped, but I don't know who took him or where they went. Missing kid, huh? Well, you came to the right man, if not the right place. I've been cooped up in here for weeks. Turns out the runaway daughter I came here to find wasn't kidnapped. She's Skinny Malone's new flame. And she's got a mean streak. Anyway, you got troubles, and I'm glad to help. But now ain't the time. Let's blow this joint. Then we'll talk. Uh, you know. Speech bubble head. What is that? Thing? All vendors have 100% more, uh, not 100%, have 100 more caps for barter. So when we buy and sell stuff, crew here used to be small or time. it's mostly when we sell stuff, they'll have a hundred caps more and for us to give us first our stuff. Until they found this place. Don't know what happened to the previous owners, but they're not exactly around to charge rent. An empty vault. Perfect hideout. Okay, let's get out of here. He'll follow us. Will he follow us or we'll like go and it'll be like way back? Well, just like any freaking RPG, they'll end up far behind and then just catch up right away. Not wrong way. I'm gonna go downstairs. Which means we have to go over here. Yes. Is that the way down? Whatever. I'll just jump down if I can. Am I gonna let me down? No. There we go. No, there was no way over there. Oh. Hey. Come on, dude. We need more AP so we can get better shots with the more shots. Yay, we leveled! Yay! What are we, seven now? 
I, think. I believe so. Yes. Yay. Um. What do we want? Can't get good nut two yet. We could do um. We could do extra lock picking. Um, anything that's actually lit up and not just a silhouette. I'm trying to think about not automatic pistols, but we don't really want a pistol. Maybe rifleman won't help us right now, but when we upgrade the other gun, yeah, do the rifle. Here. This door's on the frets. Let me see if I can get it open. Come on, Vic, get the damn door open. Almost got. There we are. <laughs> Hell of a lot easier to do when the lock isn't on the other side. Let's go. <gasps> right, so. nice. Ah, blow his head off. Yep. <laughs> Who's there? I got a loose huh? I got the fidgets. You're dead. <laughs> nice. Nice. Get it! Just look at those exploding heads. Anything in the crate? We'll find out. 18 body pins remaining. Well, that's plenty. Got it. Nothing we really want right now. Oh, wait, we'll take that cap stash, though. I mean, all that junk is good for when we start building our uh, settlements, but. Get it, get it, get it! Hurry! Nice! That's a badass in the head! It's a lot of that 45 caliber. Not so much on the The rest of his boys are waiting for us somewhere. The name's uh, ironic, but don't let that fool you. He's dangerous. Another locked door. It shouldn't be too. Come hard. on, Vic. Okay, I got it. But I hear big fat footsteps on the other side. Once we step through this door, get ready for anything. Here we go. Nikki, what are you doing? You come into my house, shoot up my guys? You have any idea how much this is gonna set me back? I wouldn't be here if it weren't for your two-timing dame, Skinny. You ought to tell her to write home more often. Oh, poor little Valentine. Ashamed you got beat up by a girl. I'll just run back home to daddy, shall I? Should have left it alone, Nikki. This ain't the old neighborhood. In this vault, I'm king of the castle, you hear me? And I ain't letting some private dick shut us down now that I finally got a good thing going. I told you we should have just killed him! 
But then you had to get all sentimental. All that stupid crap about the old times. Dala, I'm handling this. Skinny Malone's always got things under control. Oh, yeah? Then what's this lady doing here, huh? Valentine must have brought her here to rub us all out. What's going on? What's the deal with you people and Nick anyway? Darla's a runaway. Her father wanted me to bring her back home. Turns out she skipped town to be with my old pal Skinny Malone. Mob boss. Never thought he'd manage to scrape together a big enough crew to take over a vault. Guess life's full of surprises. <gasps> hey, who's running this show here? You got something to say? Say it to me. Uh, you and Nick? You and Nick know each other? <laughs> yeah. This troublemaker here used to be a real headache back in the day. Before we got kicked out of the old neighborhood. <laughs> Must have done this dance a hundred times. Enemies are kind of the closest thing you get to friends in these parts. <laughs> now quit stalling. You're gonna talk? Talk. Attack him. You're fat, you're ugly, and it's time you and your crazy bitch <laughs> said goodbye. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> Where's Darla? You're fat, you're ugly. That was a hell of an insult. Lighter or heavier with all those holes in him. <laughs> Bullets probably add a few ounces. <laughs> so is he heavier or lighter now that he's got been now he's dead with all those bullet holes? An awkward conversation with Darla's parents when I tell them their daughter bit the big one. Well, at least the case is closed. Let's get out of here. There's a service ladder that should take us right to the surface. I mean, calling somebody fat and ugly will definitely get pissed them off. Ooh. Money helmet. That'll be a hat for us. Let's put that on. Cause we're not wearing a helmet right now. There we go. I'll protect us from headshots a little bit. Is it less damage? Is that what the helmet does? Yeah, they'll do less damage to us. On that particular limb, which heads our limb now, apparently. Oh, okay. What does it usually think of the head as a limb? Well, I mean, I guess it is connected to your neck. Loading, loading, loading! Yep. Wild load, so I want to let you guys remind you guys that we have a reaction channel where we react to music. Uh, it's called Amber Truth Reacts. Information will be down in the description. Go take a look and subscribe. The channel's obviously got a lot more subscribers than this one, but you never know. You might like something you see or hear, and we'd really appreciate any help. Yep, we appreciate all we can get. Just past one month on that channel. Ah, look at that Commonwealth sky. 
never thought anything so naturally ominous could end up looking That's kind so of inviting. Look bad. Looks Thanks pretty. for getting me out. How did you know where to find me anyway? Go? Not many people knew where I went. Wait, didn't we already answer what of these? No. I don't know. Uh, Ellie, I think? I don't know. Oh. Your secretary, Ellie. She sent me. She did? I should give her a raise. Now, you mentioned something about your son, Sean, and how he went missing. I want you to come to my office in Diamond City. Give me all the details. Besides, I think you've earned a chance to sit down and clear your head. Uh, meet you there. I'll meet you there. See you in Diamond City. There we go, we completed that. And we leveled! Huh? We leveled! Yay! What do we need? Um... I don't know. That bottle cap silver is the one for this one. Scoundrel. Help us find more ammo. Go back to Diamond City. Oh, we'll oh, go oh, the market. So always have to go through another load screen. Like load screen to get to Diamond City, and then load screen once we walk into Diamond City to the market. So just jump right to the market so we don't have to do that next load screen. Hey, you're in the paper, right? You're 200 years old. Looking pretty good for your age, huh? Guess hitting on us. Ellie? Are you here? Nick? Oh god, it's really you. <laughs> well, it's hard to mistake this mug for anyone else. <laughs> you keep laughing at death. Someday death's gonna laugh back. Not as long as I got a few friends to back me up. You saved Nick, this agency, and my job. Thank you. About my case. Can we get started on my case? Oh, of course. There's just a small clerical thing we need to clear up. Here. I know an amount wasn't on the table when you went out to find him, but... You deserve a reward. Plus a little something extra. You know, if you're looking for work... A one no fedora. On and a bat... I said bottle sure cap 100. A yeah. Whoa. And a one faded trench coat. At a time, Ellie. Our new friend needs our help first. All right, let's get down to business. Take a seat. Make yourself comfortable. You're trying to find someone who's gone missing. The devil is in the details. Tell me everything you can, no matter how painful it might be. I guess... Describe the murder. My husband was... Murdered. He was just trying to... Keep them from taking Sean and they... They just, they just... It's okay, you don't need to say anything more. So, we're talking about a group of cold-hearted killers. But they waited until something went wrong to resort to violence. What else can you tell me? Describe Sean. We're looking for my baby, Sean. He's less than a year old. Why would anyone take him? Good question. 
Why your family in particular? And why an infant? Someone would be taking on all of his care, and a baby needs a lot of it. Now well, that confirms it. This isn't a random kidnapping. Whoever took your kid had an agenda. Hmm. There's a lot of groups in the Commonwealth that take people. Raiders, super mutants, the gunners. And of course, there's the Institute. The Institute? So, you think this Institute is responsible? Well, they're the boogeymen of the Commonwealth. Something goes wrong, everyone blames them. Easy to see why. Those early model synths of theirs strip whole towns for parts, killing everything in their way. Then you got the newer models, good as human, that infiltrate cities and pull strings from the shadows. Worst of all, no one knows why they do it, what their plan is, or where they are. Not even me. And I'm a synth myself. <laughs> a discarded prototype, anyway. You're a prototype? You're a prototype? As far as I know. Never seen any other synth like myself. There's the older ones that are dumb as rocks and all metal. And there's the newer ones that are almost human. I'm somewhere in between. I guess five. Either way, I need to find Sean. You're right. The speculation is getting us off Probably track. Probably should stop soon. Let's focus on what you saw. What did these kidnappers look like? I get a drive outfit. Um... The woman was dressed in, uh... I think it was a kind of hazard suit. The man had some sort of metal brace on his arm. Maybe some kind of improvised armor? A lot of hired guns do that to look tough. The hazard suit is interesting. Not many mercs can afford something that fancy. What else do you remember about them? Here it the man who killed my husband, he had a handgun. I didn't get a clear look at it, but that sound. Could have been a large caliber revolver. Huh. I'm starting to get a clearer picture of the kind of man our perp is. Anything more you can tell me? Um, bald and scarred. <laughs> One of them came right up to me. Bald head, scar across his left eye. Wait. It couldn't be. You didn't hear the name Kellogg at all, did you? Quit like... Kellogg? Who is he? Do you think he has Sean? Hmm. It's way too big of a coincidence. Ellie, what notes do we have about the Kellogg case? The description matches. Bald head, scar, reputation for dangerous mercenary work, but no one knows who his employer is. And he bought a house here in town, right? And he had a kid with him, didn't he? Yeah, that's right. The house in the abandoned West Stands. The boy with him was around 10 years old. Uh, it's not... There's no way that could be Sean. Yeah, big difference between an infant and a ten-year-old. There's a pretty big difference, yeah. Track. I'd say so. He could have a son of his own. Or maybe he's turned kidnapping into a bad habit. In any event, they both vanished a while back. No trace. Let's you and I take a walk over to Kellogg's last known address. See if we can snoop out where he went. Security doesn't really go to that part of town, but you two? should still be careful i always am <laughs> okay guys that's where we're gonna end it for today um let's save it here don't forget to check out our reaction channel and next week we will put out another video so hopefully see you guys in the next one bye bye